Yeah, I did the check. Tony, when you think back to the curtains. What, they went up Honestly, right? subs, if you didn't watch the play, the uh, film of Mark and I putting up the curtains, you don't know what you've missed. Whoa! Yay! Yeah. Brilliant! Yeah. <coughs> oh, nice. oh, that, that looks so, so nice. nice. Hey! So nice! Oh, I love it! Well yeah. done, how you did kill yourself? No. That's really straight, Mark. It is really straight. I'm having to measure it that right up with the really door, good. with that. Yeah. It's very solid. It's very solid. So there you go, that's gone up. What do you think about having my one there? Because I can put that one up quickly. Yeah. Yeah? Good. So, three paintings up. Maddie's back. Hopefully we're going to watch Euphoria tonight. Oh, yeah. I really hope so, because let's, let's face it, it's Leonardo DiCaprio's favourite show on telly. And a we're having curry. a Saturday night curry. Yay. Joe Wicks, do not be looking or commenting on this. <laughs> Joe Wicks says it's okay. Does he? Yeah. Did he tell you that? I was watching that this morning on the story. Was he? Oh, did you watch him on Insta Story more than you look into my eyes? Mm. What, how has this shifted? I had the crush, not you. Look into my eyes, look into my eyes. She's got the crush, Mum. I know. Oh, wow. Oh. Kiki, do you know that Daddy painted that for me? He did. Yeah. It was one of my birthday presents he years did. ago. He did. Really? Yeah. It's incredible, isn't it? Not one of those really annoying people that can do anything. It looks great. Though. Oh, I know a lot of them. Yeah. I know, aren't they annoying? Yeah. I know a lot of them. She said. I did it with love. Do you know Daddy did that for me? Yeah. That painting. Kiki I remember didn't believe going us. in whenever he painted it. Whenever he painted. Do you remember there was a girl that was here? Kirsty. Yeah. Kirsty. It looks great. I should do more. I, I was wondering whether I could do more poems for people. You could do them to order. Excuse me, I've got stuff around my... Don't go away! Yeah. Hi, mate. Morning. Morning. Oh, she's turned into Joe Wicks, look. Morning. Morning. It's not falling on either side of my head. <laughs> Gonna I go, think, he's I gonna think, go and run in Richmond up and down a hill. Look, it's so like him. Oh my god, I'm gonna curl it. <laughs> we should do a, we should do a, we should do an ideal and a, look what we've woken up to. Look what's on the wall. Look, look, look at this. It's like we vaguely live in a grown-up house. It's only taken us four years. <laughs> Because we've got stuff. Okay. This is really grown up. We've got. Look, look what we've got. We've got a plate from remote control that we support this a couple of years ago because we never know what to do with anything because we never do anything. But look. But the problem is, none of us can see the remotes on it. It doesn't look like the remotes oh, are but on we'll it. We'll get to know that the remotes are on it. But you know what's good about it? You don't see loads of remotes. Oh, hang on, they've, they've placed it. I'm going to put a PlayStation 3 in there. And look, Lisa bought Kiki this years ago. Aren't they? Oh, look. They're so cute. She used to cut twins. when she was innocent and she was sweet. And now they're just kids. Now they're just teens. Mice and boxes. I love mice All right, guys. Going to do my workout later. Guys, I want you to take a bet on how... I want, this is what I want, right? I want you to nag us in the comments below when you see us getting messy and things piling up on the side. Like, we're not allowed to put anything on there. Okay. What, 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 what there's a mouse? Yeah, but I've put the mouse on that there so you can't put anything on it. What else have you put there? Because there's newspapers and I'm not putting any glasses newspapers and, and, you're the one is hair. You're the one who's going to put glass oh, on there. Oh, <laughs> All right, guys. Can I make can myself you, can some you breakfast? Can you left this here? Maddie. Not me, not me. I'll put my cans in the right, bin. Leave that for to move it. What, you're gonna say it to her in front of her boyfriend? Yeah. She won't like you. Is parenting about being liked? No, you totally think it is. God, you go to pieces if you think they don't like you for a split second. That's not true. That means they've got total leverage on me with everything. Yes, it is. Come on, comments below. How many of you women would say that it's always got to be us that isn't liked and daddies will have to be lovely? It's not true. I told them off what? for not reading the other day. Yeah, but what you tend to do is one major blow up. No, it wasn't and then major. everyone hates you. No, we're, no. And then you spend the next six months trying to make everyone <laughs> love you too much. I didn't do a major blow up. No, no, the problem is, is that if you don't blow up at all, even a minor little kind of correction seems like a blow up. No, but the problem is with kids whose dad is the big, fun, happy, lovely one. 
when the daddy goes mad, it's so awful for them. It hurts them so much. Whereas me, I can never hurt them. <laughs> Sorry, I, I keep being drawn back to... Who's the chap on the right of shot? All right, guys. <laughs> so weird. If only I had... Whatever you do, do not show my legs. If only I had the legs. six pack. Do not show my legs. What legs? With these awful cut-off shorts. <laughs> Don't show. I showed you your feet last night. Don't. You better not have. If you put that in, you're going to be in massive trouble all day. You better not. Don't check my Instagram, mate. You know what I'm saying? You better not. Uh, look, do you know who you start to walk like when you get like that? Do you remember the feet of the maid in the Tom and Jerry cartoons? Mm. You're, you're Funny enough, because I had to play the legs of the maid. In the Tom and Jerry advert? No, in a cat, some cat advert. Yeah, I remember you saying that you had to... It was one of your pulling stories with me. You were telling me how you had the calves of a god, goddess or something. Isn't that right? No, Calf. The calves of the woman in the Tom and Jerry. <laughs> oh. No, no, I had to have 50s legs. 50, apparently in the 50s, they had shapely legs. But now it's all about the straight legs. For those of you knowing, my next, want to know, my next book is this, Growing Things. It's a series of sort of horror stories. Entertaining but deeply unsettling. His writing has a way of... Sneaking under your skin and messing with your head. Sounds like my cup of tea. Sneaking under your skin and messing with your head. That's what I do to Nadia on a regular basis. Have I snuck under your skin and messed with your head today yet? Piss me off. What do you mean? Do you mean piss me off? Oh, I meant sneak under your skin and mess with your head. No. No. I feel like there's a lot to do before people get... There isn't, actually. I'm afraid to say there isn't. There is. There's, there's no distraction. Fucking artworks lent everywhere. Bags of stuff that need to go to charity shops. It's just carnage. What are you talking about? No, but all those bags from the charity shop can go in there. They don't need to go anywhere. They're not sorting out the charity shops. I have to okay. say. But listen, I'm going to put. Can I just? We, I'm just going to put. Gr the... Just going to put. Um, so look, all this Damien stuff and her here. Stuff. Because we've got people coming to lunch, we'll just put all this stuff. We'll put it by the door over there. In there, that's clear in two seconds. Look, here is nearly tidy. I've made most of the lunch. You'd be pleased to know I recycled the bags for life yesterday. These aren't new bags for life. We're never getting another new bag. You're walking in that strange way with your hands in front of you like that. Am I? Sorry. So Nadia's <coughs> currently going through, you might have seen on our live vlog last night that we've got guests coming today, we're friend Miranda, <coughs> who um, I once wanted to marry actually, Miranda. She's so lovely. Um, <coughs> but Nadia's make, obviously committed herself to a marinating dish of hooli hooli chicken. Now I'm regretting it. Now I think it sounds really exciting for one reason alone. I would like Nadia to cook it wearing a hooli hooli dress. I haven't got a hooli hooli dress. Or a hooli hooli skirt. I haven't got a hooli hooli. She's not even, maybe she could hula hoop. But look, hula we are. It has to be grilled. Oh, that's a pain in the ass. But we are upcycling like mad in this household right now. And look. We're actually using what used to be the television stand as a potential table beside the sofa so that when Nadia's watching the Kardashians, though I have to confess, I haven't seen you watch the Kardashians in about the last year. What's going on? I watched them privately. All right, okay. It's starting to rain. We were going to green finger I know, hell. I was going to we cook green the chicken in the oven and then crisp it up on the barbecue. It's so annoying. We were going to green finger hell. Do you think hell? the barbecue would stay okay underneath the... Oh, it looks great, no. isn't it? Hello, we missed you. Hello. Go from the sublime to the ridiculous. They're going up everywhere. Going up, oh, okay. Maddie said she goes, you won't be able to stop now. Hello. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Morning, stars. <laughs> <laughs> You're an old reliable. <laughs> I'm an old reliable. Cup of tea, please. Morning. Oh. You don't need tea there, Mum. Did you no. just dribble? I did just dribble. I do. Did you dribble because you're old? Shut up. Look behind you. Ah! Oh, lovely. Look in front of you. Ah, lovely. I love it. Oh, it's going back. Did you sleep well? No. <laughs> That's no. a terrible night. That was up and down. You must have heard me about 50 times. One of those nights. Nice. I had There's to sleep down do. here because Nadia was taking up the whole bed. Oh no! Yeah. You're, You're surrounded by skulls. Shoved 
I did. <coughs> and then your legs came kicking back. Nadia's making hoi hoi chicken. Hoi hoi. What hoi is it hoi. called? Hoi hoi. Hoi hoi. It's starting to rain, Mum. <laughs> Do you have a... <laughs> <It's> very... <laughs> Sorry, I've made Nanny die on the TV she got. I watched you try and lift it. <laughs> both, both hands, both hands. Look. Do you want me to pour it into a smaller yes, cup? Thank you, Bill. <laughs> Yeah, let me do it because otherwise you'll spray it everywhere. Let me do it. <laughs> yeah, it does seem a bit strange the way we've been characterised like that. I love West Side Story. Yeah, you've always said that. Look, the only thing. West Side Story. I've always liked Chorus Line. Chorus Line yeah. is the other one. Chorus, chorus Line. line. Um, oh, all that jazz. Like that. Well, they, they will. They did. They you will. remember it was awful, apparently. Do you like? Do you like musical subs? Are you musical people? I like, or I I'm not a Stephen Sondheim fan. I, no, I went to I see like Sunday in the Park with George. Oh, that was the most awful thing. I, I, I had to run for the hills. That was the most awful. And I was trapped. I, did, I wanted to do yours and Nadia's thing. Saw Sunday in the Park with George. I ended up Monday on the edge of the Thames with Mark. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was in the middle of a row and it was like, oh mm. my god. Middle of a row? Middle of a row, row of people. Oh. So she can get out. I know you, you heard say that. Say the coughing fit, or say you're well, going to be sick. You know, this was ages ago and I thought, I didn't believe in leaving leaving theatres, but no. I had to get out. You get it was out. So... You've got to get out. Nadia, what's your tactic when you're booking tickets you now? You two just leave, don't you? We you, just leave. You, no, but you always have these tactics around certain chairs. Don't oh you? yeah, you have to be on the edge so you can get out. But when you, we're not quite on the edge, you've said quite dramatic things to get out of Oh place. yeah, I will what? say... Like I'm having a I'm diabetic gonna, attack. No, I start retching. Di- retching. I start retching to get out. <laughs> <laughs> haven't yeah. actually done it yet, but I would. All right. I always think of the Julie Walters thing from Victoria Wood. I'm a diabetic, let me through. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Remember that woman who passed out at the uh, Royal Court? Had a sort of seizure. I remember that one. I remember yes. lots of somebody went. You weren't. Yeah, somebody, yeah. Died. Oh, somebody, somebody died. Somebody died at, t- at the top. No, it wasn't Toby Jones. It was Jonathan Price <laughs> in the goat. Oh my God! Not Jonathan Price didn't die by the way. No, 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 no not Jonathan. Price. It was awful How did he for the actors. It on stage? Well, they were just. They were five minutes from the end of the play, and it's a difficult play. And they'd both. They'd all work themselves yeah. into a thing, and then at the end, I was in the circle first row, yeah. which I'm never in while I was saying that. Yeah. And as we looked down round this side, first of all, we could see it was serious and that people were coming in. And then they came in and they pulled a thing over his head. Oh my god! And then they took him out, and then his wife, the, this woman, went out with him. And the poor actors, they were literally. No, they wouldn't be annoyed with somebody end. dying, but they wouldn't have known somebody was dying, was they? No. They would have known that was they, different to somebody. Just, yeah. I mean, actors literally despise people who cough. You are, I'm not surprised. No, I'm not surprised. And I just don't, under, like, if I had a cough, you and I, even if I had really expensive tickets, I wouldn't go to the, I no. would not. Oh, no, if you're ill. Because, yeah, yeah. because, I know. I've sat in theatres with people literally, like, I know. and like sneezing, and just yeah. right on you, yeah. and actors hate it. And in fact, Anna Massey, I remember when I was, um, She's a good old actress, Anna Yeah, she was. Did. Anna Massey. She is. She is. is she, Anna? When I was an usherette, because I used to be an usherette, you know, at taming tickets at the National Theatre. And I remember everyone said, oh, she's such a madam, Anna Massey. She's such a madam, Anna Massey. Because she used to ask the usherettes to be looking around before the play. Yeah. To see where people, if people were coughing. Really? And to ask them to stop or offer them a cough. Oh, well, because it totally ruins the experience. Well, it does. The when that woman the other day kept... She would go out, have a coffee fit, come back, then go out again, oh, have I a coffee fit, and like come that. back. It's yeah. like, no, you need to go home or see No, you in the end, Yoshuette wouldn't let it up. It's an Ibsen play. Imagine you, everybody would probably be grateful. Oh, the funny, funniest place to go is the Globe in the summer, though, because oh, if yes. you sit down, you can see people dropping like flies yeah, yeah. in the uh, where people are standing up because they're just faint. I said to one of the ushers once. Somebody might not know the Globe Theatre. It's a theatre oh. in London where it's like like it was in Shakespearean times. So you're standing yeah. up, so yeah. you yeah. stand for, for a fiver. They get you to stand. Yeah, it's an amazing place, guys. You, you it's, it's next to Tate Modern, and you, the, um, what do they call the people that stand? They've got a name. The groundlings. The groundlings. And you stand there, and um, for five pounds, if you can stand for the thing. But it's really interactive. They interact with the yeah, audience. Yeah, they throw like they buckets throw, of piss over. You know, and yeah. Stuff like that, I mean, it? if it's somebody's really... smelly on stage, they bring out bits of bacon and yeah. throw them out. It's a bit like a pantomime to yeah, that thing. The, every summer, they do one or two midnight performances of oh, things like Macbeth or whatever. Yeah, yeah. It's so atmospheric because they have hog roasts going. They have all the lights going. Oh, you I feel, love to go you to feel like you're in Shakespearean London. Did yeah. I not take you? Did I not take? Was yeah. it me and you? 
You've taken me a couple oh, right. of times. Oh, right, where they had the witches crawling yeah. up the outside yeah. of the... Macbeth it's brilliant, it's really good. It's really good. Actually, anyway, we're talking yeah. about musicals because it's Kiki's birthday next week. Yes. And we're taking her to a musical. And it's not a surprise, so I don't know why we're whispering. No, I don't know. But for some reason, me and Nan have been characterised as not liking musicals. And we do. All by the Nadia. Day. By for Nadia. For some reason. Yeah. Mark. No, I can understand. Because you say it all the time. What do I say? What say about name musicals. the musical? Yeah. No, what? I can. I, I think she's equate. I think she's put me with you. She's put but, because you loved, for, for example, Jesus Christ Superstar. Love it. I hated it. Yeah. And so she's sort of added you yeah. to yeah. me. Yeah. In that love. Oh, yeah, I yeah, loved hate. West Side yeah. Story. I've, I've always loved West Side. Story. I loved La La Land, the film. You know, if you're looking oh, at I musicals, love, yeah, love, come love. on, get real, get with the program. I love bloody musicals. It's got, just got to be and like. Now he loves me. What's no, it no. Well, it's not bollocks. I just don't like. Really, you do not love me. I don't what? like musicals like Tina Turner. What? The life of Tina. Tina. No, the life no, of there Tina never Turner. Been a there is. It's on in the West End. It's on in the West End. Go on, say you don't like musicals like Thriller. No, yeah, probably yeah, all that sort of stuff. If it's a good musical, I like a good musical. Pippin. We loved Pippin, Nadia, in New Bob York. Fosse. Oh, I love Pippin. Bob Fosse. Fosse. We loved it. Yeah. I, in fact, I can't. I'm hard pressed to name a musical I don't like. Can I just say, Mark? What? You're completely rewriting history. Tell me the ones I hate. Stephen and you're Stephen doing Sondheim, the cleavage again. That's quite a lot. What? Stephen Sondheim has quite a lot. He's practically all lot. Apart from West Side Story, that he wrote the libretto. I think I'm going to make something. He wrote the lyrics for the film. I'm going to make something called a blueberry crisp. It's Bernstein did the music. Music and Stephen Sondheim did the lyrics. I promise you, go and check it out. True. He was Could on set with true? Steven Spielberg. Whoa. Um, listen, Mark. Um, she doesn't know with the little say, head. Switch it. The little head. Stop. Little oh, tiny, so tiny, tiny so head. Annoying. So annoying. So annoying. Can I just ask you a question about going live? What, the television programme from the 1980s starring Gail Porter? No, you guys last night going live. Oh, yeah. Can I ask you a question? Ask yes, a ask it. it. How come you two guys say to each other in this kitchen, oh, we'll go live. Yes. You both agree. Something goes on with that little machine. And then suddenly millions of people are saying, love Nanny Di, love Nanny Di, love all of you, love all of you. <laughs> How do they know that you're, you've said go live? Because they're, they're logged into the same app. So imagine. Well, does it come up with a sign? Saying, on their phones it does. Like the BBC. But they have to be They'll, next to their phones. Yeah, of course they do. They have to be near a phone. They're not just walking through life and that's suddenly goes, Nanny dies of it. No, no, I mean, that's Blade <laughs> oh, okay. Runner styling. Well, yeah. Yeah, so their phone, a little red indicator, like a text, will come oh. up saying, Nadia Sawara and family have gone live. Oh. Then they press on it and they see your little muggins. And then they go, oh, let's say hello to Nanny Dye. It shows quite a lot of commitment, that, doesn't it? Yes, that's why we love our subscribers. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, more commitment than you're showing right now, Mum. <laughs> Shut up! That's so unnecessary. Come, on, come over here, come and see this, look. amazing. Three days later, Mum's still talking about Fosse. Catherine! Oh, sorry. Yeah, it's lovely, it's sweet. Your enthusiasm is infectious. Look. It's not straight! Oh, I, haven't, I haven't nudged it straight yet. No, you can move it, you can move it either side. Oh, thank God for that. No, it's beautiful. It's the right sort of height, isn't it? Yeah, no, it's exactly right. Does that look straight? Yes, it looks straight. That looks, it's funny because close up it doesn't feel straight. No, it's perfect. It's perfect. Oh, it does go with the telly well, doesn't it? Great. What else are we going to put up? Bob Fosse had a very dramatic life. Another version. hour later, <laughs> you're in danger of becoming a Bob Fosse ball. I'm very much in danger of becoming. Chi Chi, what are you eating? Are we allowed to show what Chi Chi's eating? Yeah. What is it? He's eating a carcass. It a looks carcass? like the carcass of a small animal. What is that? What do you think it is? I don't know. What, what is it? It might be. You, you. What do you think it might be, Mum? Have a stab at it. It looks like newspaper to me. Oh no, it's a proper carcass. Michael Dukakis. <laughs> you come so close to being from really do. Where's she got it from? Nadia, gave her it. Oh, oh, oh she's really chewing on that. Have you told Chi Chi about Bob Fosse? Yeah, she went like this. <laughs> <laughs> With her legs. 
<laughs> you get that sense of sinister, you know, sinister sort of fear. Yeah. She shouldn't have just sat back down and, and, and looked at the television. Well, she this conversation has been going on for the last 45 minutes about the new Tarantino film. At times it's got close to violence, but isn't it lovely? Mother and son arguing about... Tarantino, you should be really proud of yourself. Subs, I'm just asking Mark and Nadia if they'll order me something from their thing because I can't do that. From and Amazon. Amazon. And sometimes with some books I can't get from my course. One book. And this, which I'm going to show you both and you'll both fall on the floor because you'll think, what the F-U-C-K? You have to order me this. What is it? See? It's a water thing that you, you put the water in and then you use it. Blast it in between your you teeth. You blast it in between very, your very teeth. Very, you. My it's the only well. thing that the, my dental hygienist said, you have to get one of these now. And I said, well, where do I get one? And so she said, we can get it on Amazon. So here we are. It's the end of Nanny Dye's contribution to this weekend's vlog. Yeah, She's sorry. tying her tying my... thing around her thingy. God, She's on. talked herself stupid about Bob Fosse. And, uh, and Tarantino. And Tarantino. <laughs> And jibber jabber, jibber jabber. Now she's wandering off with Forky in her bag. With Forky, do the subs know what Forky is? Or they'll just think of it. Have you got him at hand? Yes. Oh, you haven't got him out of the box there. No, no, but he, he's very visible. There's Forky. The girls and say I Kurt look like Kaboom. Him. I've got the long arms. You do. You've got the wonky eyes. Go like Duke that. Kaboom. The hair sticking up. Oh. He's quite cool too, isn't he? Oh, he's very cool, but I'll come to him later. We love the Canadians. I'm at the moment getting on with... don't know if the Canadians are like Duke Kaboom, though. Maybe they do. Maybe you do, do you? Got a lot of people in Canada who like us. We want to get out to Canada. Anyway, there's Nanny Di. You don't seem to have enough bags on you, Mum. I've got quite a lot of bags, though. Yeah, um, watch this car. So, uh, so what does the week hold for you? Ah, I was going to make a suggestion. I think there should be another week where you take photographs. Oh, okay. And I think you should do photographs of Forky in different strange places. What do you think? Oh, you don't mean in my flat, you mean Yeah, around. in your flat and in, ta in town. Take your camera and take Forky. And, and I put it onto the um, focus. Yeah, yeah put it on the, on the auto focus, yeah. I, I think I switched it over for you. You but did, just put, I think. put Forky in ever more strange scenarios in London so that Forky is kind of living your life for the week. I do like having a task, yeah, even well, there if you I go. don't fulfil the task. It's a I curiously like infantile it. task. I mean, they used to do it with Kiki and Maddie. They'd send them off for the week with the bear. Yeah. And then we'd have to take photos of them with their bear. Oh, that's right. I've but really we're going to do that. Nanny Die with Forky. Why not? I think it could almost be a series of photographs. Garden that could be shown at the North National Portrait Gallery. Exactly. And we'll all look at them as part of your general oeuvre. <laughs> part of my general oeuvre. Oh, look. Anyway, do you want to say goodbye to the subs? Subs! I'm leaving you early earlier this time. Yeah, I'm... you're not going to stay and socialise with our friends. And... Well, it's such dreadful weather, we can't really get into the garden. No. I've got shopping that I need to do at home. Are you going to go I'm... to the supermarket? Yeah. Oh. And I'm coming well, back. Well, I think you need to take Forky with you. Dude, I haven't got my camera now. No, but, I know. Um, but, oh, uh, we'll say bye-bye. We've bye -bye, had fun. Bye-bye, and I'll That's, see you next, yeah. well, midweek, really. Yeah, it's sort of Kiki's birthday. Kiki's okay, well, we're going to do the shot that a lot of you find really depressing and sad, well, which is... Well, don't do it, then. Well, no, no, we're going to do it, because <laughs> we, we like to generate emotional responses on this channel. God. So, here we go. Does he irritate you, Subs? Yeah, yeah, I irritate everyone. Oh, okay, good. That's what I am. That's part of my DNA. Okay. Let's get the show. Put the music on afterwards. Yeah, the music will be there now, right behind you. Oh, will it? Yes, yeah, happening right now as we speak. There it is. At where? Yeah, I'll have edited it on. Oh. Yeah. No trains. Hey. Eh? The trains are all fine. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's just the water. Oh right, that looks so dramatic. It looks like an apocalypse. <laughs> Are down, machines are oh down, no. Are okay, so, oh, so go, uh, Highbury and Islington, the normal platform. Pla yeah, platform five, yeah. five minutes. Yeah. Thank you Good very day. much, love. Oh, bye-bye, love. Take care. Bye-bye, bye-bye. See, bye -bye. see, bye -bye. see you in the week. Love you. Put the music on. Yeah, the music's on. Hold on. Cue music. Say cue music. Say what? Cue music. Cue music. Say it really quickly. Go slow, look sad.